Well, for something completely different, I thought uh, we would take a look at my wife's perfume bottle collection. Now, this is, is not necessarily my cup of tea per se, but as with everything else, um, I think a certain amount of appreciation has to go into um, what other people collect and for what reasons and that type of thing. So I thought we'd take a little look at this today. So I have my wife with me and um, we're gonna just kind of go over some of these pieces. Um, so Sandra, um, what can you tell me about some of these on the shelf? Uh, I know that these, the two little ones, the two little ones I got as a teenager. Now why, um, why collect perfume bottles? I don't know. I've always liked them and I think they're pretty and they're all different. Okay. In their own little ways. So you wouldn't want like a drug hard noir, um, no, you know, not necessarily. Clone a bottle. In no, no. You know, no, I mean, you know, having, you know, I collect action figures, um, that type of thing. So no, I, just I think completely all... get the, yeah, the no, collecting I, just, I like them because they're all so different Okay. in their own ways and they're all pretty and I don't know, it's just, they're different. I just like them. What about anything special on this shelf? The green ones in the back, my husband and my children got me. Okay. Uh, those are mostly from my mom. And your mom is passed away. Yes. So that's a nice memory. So those mean a lot to me. Yeah. These I got when I lived at home. Some of them. So a turtle. A little turp. That's pretty neat. Reminds me of our son. The car in the back, the blue one. Uh huh. Corvette. The Corvette and the blue, uh, the green truck in the back. Remind me, they're from my father-in-law, and that means a lot to me too. Because that would be my dad, not like your first husband. Right. Okay. <laughs> not that you had a first husband. I do not have a first husband. That I know of. You are my first husband. The little elephant with the um... elephant. Yep. Yeah. Beehive. That's pretty. That, that's actually one I like a lot. I think that's really neat looking. I actually think that's from our kids. The beehive. Yeah. Little ladybugs. Yeah, they are all. all they're all unique, that's which I think cool. is neat. They each have a little bit of character to them. Mm -hmm. Now these get a little more ornate down here. Yeah. The bird's cute. Mm-hmm. And when did you start collecting these? Like to say like, oh, you know, not that you woke up one day and realized, oh, I, I have a few perfume bottles, but when did it become the, oh, I'd like to get more and have a collection of these? Either late teens or early twenties. So a while ago. Yeah. Yeah. Let's start at the bottom here. I love the beach. So that shell is. Yeah, that's a neat one. Mm. Now, do you think any of these, or many of these, were actually used to house perfume? Yeah, or... the one in the back, in the middle, right there. Yeah. That is actually from an old, um, Beautiful is the name of the perfume. It's by Estee Lauder, and that's one of my favorite perfumes. This is just an empty bottle. I've never seen that before, so I don't know when it's from. Oh, you never remember, like, it the, wasn't the yours? The one in the back. No, that wasn't mine. I, okay. I don't know where I got that from, so somebody okay but do you think like this the shell one mm -hmm. like the flower coming out no of it, i don't think it was ever that perfume. is just made to be sold mm -hmm. as a never bottle. actually housing any perfume and years ago the yellow and the blue one with tweety and taz uh, yeah. not taz my little pepe have you looked you uh, those are from warner brothers and um Again, did they did they have perfume in them? No, they were just collectible. They just come, okay. Yeah. But they're they're labeled as a perfume bottle. Mm-hmm. Okay. That had real perfume in it. The one in the middle is a lighthouse. Um, I believe you and the kids gave that to me. Okay. But I I don't know what was in it, and uh, I do think it was used for something, and I love it.
Oh, these I love too. These are yeah, these two especially I like. Yeah, those two are my favorites. I just, I don't know, I just love this shelf. I think I got that red one in the back for my mom. I just think it's cool. That is kind of neat looking. Yeah. Oh, is that glass inside it? Like red glass inside clear glass? No, it's just, um, I don't know if it's dyed or. Yeah, it's very neat looking. Yeah. They're just pretty. They're kind of pretty. <laughs> and let's see the last shelf here. These are just little ones. I just think these are pretty too. A lot of these I got from, um, well, you and the kids. And yeah, I do remember some of these. Dragonfly. Yeah. I think I got one or two from my grandmother. Oh, and again, she's, she's not with us. Right. I think this one too. Yeah, it's pretty. One of the kids gave it to you. Yeah, these... I don't think had any um, perfume in them. They were just made to be ornamental. I, I, I think so. I don't think they ever had, yeah. Well, that's what's always easy is uh, when it comes time for Christmas or birthday or Mother's Day, um, you know, what do I want to get mom? Either something with a um, snowman or a perfume bottle or some kind of lighthouse or you know, calendar or shirt towel whatever it is so um getting perfume bottles actually made it pretty easy to shop for you i'll take it all right and that's what i got for you today i thought um i thought it was a pretty unique uh, collection and since um sandy went today and moved all these upstairs from uh where she had them downstairs where I have to say they were a lot more uh, congested and I don't think you could really appreciate each one because they were kind of on top of each other. So now to be able to put them in these cabinets, um, spreads them out a little bit and you actually do get to check them out and I think you'll get a better appreciation for them. So that's what I have for you and again as always thank you for watching and I will catch you later. If you enjoyed the video, please take the time to like and subscribe.